Hello everyone, Steve Sebo back with mentaltoughnessblog.com. Chicago, I just did a TV interview on uh, downtown Chicago here on WCIU. Bumped into Montel Williams actually from the Montel Williams show. He was on right after me. And so here's my critical, <clears throat> excuse me, critical thinking question for you today. What is your tolerance for pain and rejection on the way to achieving your dream. In other words, on a scale of one to seven, seven being your don't have much tolerance for pain and rejection, and seven being you are really mentally tough and you can endure years, if it's necessary, of pain and rejection on the way to your vision or your dream. Where do you fall on that one to seven scale? <clears throat> Here's why I ask. If you're not at least a six, and you have a world-class dream, you're gonna have to rethink that dream. Because most likely it's gonna take 10 or 20 times as long to achieve the dream that you wanna dream. Talk to anyone that's achieved a world-class a world class goal or a world-class vision or dream, and it typically takes much, much longer, typically years. It's the old story of the overnight success. It reminded me of this because of Montel Williams bumping into him, who, has been on TV for years, and of course has been a great success, has battled cancer, as you might know. <clears throat> Matter of fact, when we just saw him in the studio, he was very thin. He looks good, but he's pretty thin, and if you remember years ago, he wasn't that thin. Here's a guy that's really paid the price, been on television, gone through all kinds of medical issues and problems, but here he is, 7 in the morning, doing Chicago TV right after me this morning on this show, and uh, he's still fighting forward. How about you? What is your tolerance for pain and rejection on the way to your dream? It's got to be at least a six, in my opinion, if you have any shot of really making it. So something to think about. I'm Steve Sebo from beautiful Chicago. Thanks for watching the blog. See you next time.